Welcome to San Antonio, Texas. After my mom and I were the first two members of the family to be fully vaccinated, I took my first flight to meet up with her for a little Texas road trip. Join us as we road trip north from the southern tip of Texas. In this week's video, hit all the popular spots and avoid crowds in Texas's historical heart of San Antonio. Welcome to San Antonio, Texas. I am exploring all there is to see and do in downtown San Antonio and the very first stop is of course the Alamo. The Alamo is a very famous battle for Texans, not because it was a victory but because it was a loss. They actually were outnumbered by the Mexican army here at the Alamo and they fought to the death and then at the next battle in San Jacinto, the Texas forces won and they won with the mantra of remember the Alamo. I've come to the Alamo early this morning to get some pictures and some video before everything gets too crowded. It doesn't open until 9 I believe and I have time tickets for later this afternoon at 4.30. I might go in depending on how crowded it is, we'll see. From the Alamo came a number of heroes whose names are legend in Texas. You'll find many streets that are named after them, elementary schools, men who bravely gave their lives for Texas independence. And this is one of the reasons why Texans are so proud. Above all else, I have to say that the San Antonio River Walk is probably the most popular attraction in all of San Antonio. It's basically this path along the river that has shops and restaurants all along it. It's beautiful and cool because there's shady areas and it has all the tourist restaurants you would want, including Hard Rock Cafe, which is the one I love to go to. But it's just beautiful. I'm here early in the morning before all the tourists get here and so it's gonna be a really pleasant time. This area gets super crowded around mid-afternoon when people are eating and shopping. If you come early in the morning around 9 o'clock, which is the time I'm here, it's just beautiful. There's some people jogging, the air is crisp and cool, and it's really something you could take in without too many people around. One of my favorite San Antonio attractions has always been the Tower of the Americas. This tall building was built for a World's Fair in, and it has an observation deck on top and a rotating restaurant that has pretty decent food, and it gives you great 360 views of the downtown area. I'm trying to film here, what's your problem? So 
the next stop today in downtown San Antonio is one of my family's favorites. It's called El Mercado, the market. It's a uh, Mexican market that has restaurants and souvenirs and it's just a general fun area to be in. So I think we're gonna head out. We've got some beautiful dresses and I think it's a win. So I was able to pretty easily get a free timed entry ticket to the Alamo, which is kind of cool, but they don't let you take any video or photography inside the Alamo, but there's not much to see in there anyways. It's a pretty empty um, building with a few rooms that are just like stone rooms, adobe rooms with not much in them. But you are allowed to videotape around the outside, which is what I'm doing now. Uh, they ask you to wear a mask inside, but there are of course people no, with no mask inside because this is Texas and the governor decided it was okay. So I didn't want to be in there very long anyways. not know about the Alamo is that the part that you usually see in videos and pictures that you can go into is just the chapel of the fort. All the rest of the fort is destroyed from the war and time passing by. One last stop before we finish up here in downtown San Antonio and this is at the Japanese Tea Garden which is in the same park as the San Antonio Zoo except for entrance into this tea garden is absolutely free and it is gorgeous. This place is completely Instagrammable. If you're looking for beautiful views, this is it. And you can bring your coffee here and just sit on one of the sits and enjoy the beautiful scenery. here too. It's just gorgeous and peaceful. you enjoyed this visit to downtown San Antonio. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos of my Texas road trip, please subscribe and hit the bell to be notified when new videos are available. Until next time, bye! <laughs>